Through research and my own experience, I found two habits that waste more time than any other. In today's video, I'll break down those two habits and how you can avoid them moving forward. The first habit is something I'm sure we've all done, and that is multitasking. For those of you that don't know, multitasking is just basically doing two or more things at the same time, or trying to. Now, I don't know how often or if you guys do multitask often, but let me just say, this is something that I even struggle with right now. I'm working on improving the habit and that is why I'm sharing it with you so we can improve together. Now, when I'm thinking about multitasking, the only time I can truly focus and do two things at once is maybe when I'm listening to music and doing something else. So if I go work out, for example, if I'm working out, I have my headphones on and I'm listening to the beat, I'm bumping to it, and I get to do that while I'm working out. Now, we can even break it down right there. Sometimes when I'm doing just that and I'm listening to music, I get lost in the lyrics. I don't know if anybody else does that too, but I'll get lost in the lyrics, I'm feeling myself, and I get focused so much on the music that it starts to affect my workout. Instead of finishing a workout in 30 minutes, I'm so into listening to music, my entire workout extends an additional 30 minutes, sometimes an even an hour, just because I'm trying to multitask at the same time. Now, let me give you another common example. Take a student who just got home from school. I'll play the role. Let me be that student. I got home from school. I have homework to do. I tell myself I can do the homework, but I can also scroll through my phone. I can look through my social media, I can look through my messages, I can look through emails while I'm doing homework. I get bored with my phone, I put it down. Now, I think that I can do homework alongside watching some TV. I can do both at the same time. I do this for hours and I get nowhere. My homework is due at 11.59. I need to get this to my professor. So what do I do? I turn off the TV or I shut off my phone and I focus on my homework. Why is that? Because that's the only way I know I'm going to get it done. That's the issue with multitasking. We think that we can do multiple things at once, but we're not going to be really effective at all. The hardest truth is that we are best when we focus on a specific thing. Think about it, when was the last time that you multitasked and did a really good job at both tasks at that same time? It's really unlikely that you did well or found yourself being productive when you multitask. And sort of like the examples that I've already shared, the hardest thing about multitasking is that it does waste time and we don't want to waste time. Time is valuable and we want to be able to spend it doing things effectively. So when we're multitasking, we just waste so much more additional time than we need to. The best way to fight this is just to focus on one task. If you have homework, set aside 30 minutes, set a timer for yourself, set 30 minutes aside, do your homework, take a five minute break, and then re do another task. If it was you wanted to watch TV, go watch TV for five minutes, 10 minutes, Focus on doing one task at one time, and you'll find yourself being a lot more productive doing that than trying to do multiple things at once. Now, the second habit that just wastes so much time is social media. Now, now social media is good in my sense. I'm a little biased. I work as a social media manager. I'm creating content, so I am a little pro social media. I love social media, it is an incredible tool, but let's be honest, there's been times where we waste a ton of time just scrolling through a ton of different short form content, or we're just watching random videos that we find and seem interesting, and really that wastes so much more time than we need to. Now, my issue with social media is that I tell myself I'll only watch it for five minutes, 10 minutes, just to see what's new, what, what some of my friends posted. And time and time again, I just find myself scrolling through mindlessly. And I could be in the bathroom. Oh my goodness, that's the worst. That's the worst place. I'm in the bathroom or in bed. And I tell myself five, 10 minutes. No, that turns into 30 minutes, then 40 minutes, then an hour, then two hours. And I just feel like I wasted so much time. And I did. 
I wasted too much time that I could have used to do something else. Now, what sort of solution could you have for this? Use social media for a specific purpose. What do I mean? If you're gonna use social media, use it to learn, use it to gain knowledge, or if you know you wanna search up something specific, go search that up. Otherwise, you waste a ton of time just scrolling through mindlessly, and it does waste a ton of your time that you could be using for something else. Social media is an incredible tool to learn. There's so many great videos and people out there that teach you about certain things. And of course, you can use it for entertainment and watch funny videos, whatever it is. Whenever you're on social media, do it with a purpose and you'll find yourself having a lot more time at the end of the day rather than just scrolling through and really just finding nothing that you were looking for. So just be careful with social media. I love social media. I recommend it but I'm biased. For myself, I also need to work on not scrolling through mindlessly, but I wanna share with you that finding something specific on social media is probably the best way to use it, even though we're not always going to. So just keep that in the back of your mind when you're on Instagram, YouTube, Facebook, whatever it is next time. So next time when you are using one, one of these platforms, just remember, Use it with a purpose, give yourself a reason why you're on it rather than just going into it for whatever. So two big habits that you wanna break because they waste a ton of time are gonna be multitasking and using social media without a purpose. These will eat up a ton of time if you don't fix it. And I found through my experience and a little bit of research that focusing on fixing these things can give you so much of your time back each and every day. And it really just helps improve the quality of your life by not wasting so much of it on things that you don't really care about at the end of the day.